But uh, ODM rules out cash deal with for Kenya. ODM has ruled out the possibility of sharing the funds it received from the registered political parties. I remember last, towards the end of last week, there was a story that we saw uh, of members of the ANC dictating that um, actually, even as, my, as much as the contribution to political parties is concerned, should now be directed to ANC, not the National Super Alliance. Now the constituent parties of NASA are claiming a share from uh, the allocation from the... Mm. Um, P public resources. This is where I watch. Eh? Just yeah. let the <laughs> yeah. No, you're watching to listen yeah. to them. So uh, you belong to the ODM party. When are you releasing money to ANC, Fort Kenya, and Wiper? Well, let me begin on a very light note. You know, when you start throwing stones as a partner in marriage and say it will be messy and <laughs> and, and, and very difficult. You see, now we are helping you to be messy. So if uh, ODM decides that, look, we are not sharing this anymore. We are simply assisting uh, our just brothers in this marriage <laughs> uh, for the noisy and, and very long divorce that they had asked for. But that's really on a very light note. Okay. I think the arrangement for sharing mm -hmm. was a very internal agreement. I think uh, it was a, a gentleman's agreement, if you wish. Mm -hmm. um, I hope they try and sort them out. I think uh, if you look at the the, 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 the the act itself, the way it says, it speaks about parliamentary uh, political parties and I think it's very clear there mm -hmm. as to who is entitled to be paid. Okay. The other issue as to how the partners in this coalition ended up being able to get mm -hmm. uh, resources in this mm -hmm. is through that gentleman's agreement. I hope it doesn't get trashed in the mm -hmm. many list of broken gentleman's you, agreements. As an ODM member, do you have any intentions of making sure that it succeeds? Um, no. Well, you see, things change. Things <laughs> change. Things change. <laughs> let me, let I'll me, take that for a note. I think let, me, let me clarify. Yes. You know, you know uh, Honorable Watch was not in the last parliament, mm -hmm. so he might not be knowing mm -hmm. what happened under code. Yes. I was privileged to be in the management committee of code. Mm -hmm. Even this time around, I was also in the NASA management committee. And uh, in line with the Political Parties Act, mm -hmm. there's a provision for MOUs. Mm -hmm. Parties, when they're approaching elections, can go into MOUs. Mm -hmm. And we as NASA, it's a coalition, it's registered, it's deposited with the registered political parties, mm -hmm. where it's composed of the four parties. That is uh, ANC, for the Kenya, WIPA, and, uh, and, uh, and, uh, and ODM. Mm -hmm. Now, what happened is, uh, when you look at the Political Parties Act and the Political Parties Funding, they base it on the percentage of the presidential <coughs> votes that you got. And uh, under code, mm -hmm. under code, our presidential candidate was Raila Molodinga. Mm -hmm. And the tabulation was done, and the money that was given to code, of course it comes through ODM. Because when you go to the ballot, much that he was the presidential candidate for code at that particular time, sure. the ticket was ODM. Mm -hmm. So when ODM were given the money, they looked at, the pro they looked pro at votes, then they, they calculate the money proportionately. But how do you determine the votes that are for WIPA and for... I was coming to that, so uh -huh. be listening. <laughs> yeah. I'm listening. If you I'm want to get you. the votes, uh -huh. if you want to know the votes, of uh -huh. course you'll go to your areas. Uh, each party has uh, its best areas. And uh, you go to the IBC, they'll give you the votes that your presidential candidate got in a respective uh, strongholds. Er in strongholds. Mm -hmm. Then from there, okay. you can be able to agree proportionately mm -hmm. so that you know what percentage one gets mm -hmm. in a proportionate manner. Mm -hmm. So in the last term, yeah. we were getting money from ODM. And it goes to ODM, before it comes to, they give it to us. Then I approached the registrar political parties, asked her, by then it was Lucy Ndungu. I said, why don't you just give <coughs> us the money direct? Mm -hmm. She said, it will bring an audit query. Yes. But I said, no, it should not bring an audit query because we have an MOU which has been actually registered and deposited with you as a register of political parties. Mm -hmm. parties. And that provides a, a basis, a legal framework. Then he said, yeah, I think it can work. Now, in this, in this current uh, parliament, we went under NASA. And we have a legal document showing NASA is composed of the four political parties. Mm -hmm. That is ANC, WIPA, Ford Kenya, and ODM. So the share that comes to ODM, actually, we are supposed to share. And they haven't now, since the last election. Now, the issue is, have I they? believe in sorting out things in a diplomatic manner. Have they? So the, the issue is, uh, you know, initially even this money had not been raised. I thank God with the handshake, it helped. And when you look at the money that is supposed to be appropriated to the political parties, the, the Treasury has not been even giving that money. I think it's 0.3%. Mm -hmm. And I think Honorable Watch had gone to court over that matter, contempt of court, mm -hmm. and the court ruled. And it was decided mm -hmm. that we are going to have a supplemental budget 
whereby we are going to give money to How the much? political parties. How much? It is 0.3 percent in the law. No, no, the, the actual amount that was it's about uh, 2.7 billion. Yeah, mm -hmm. they have appropriated, I think, 800 for this year, mm -hmm. including administrative cost mm. of the registrar. Mm -hmm. So the, the the difference that treasury or that was not factored in is about 2.3 billion. Yeah, okay. look at that. That needs to go into the supplementary Absolutely. budget. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. And these political parties they haven't received anything out of this. Just million. hold on, please. You see, no, we are, we are running out of time, Chris. Okay. The issue is this. Uh -huh. Uh, I think uh, discussions are going on, mm -hmm. and uh, as has Ford Kenya, we requested our big brother to extend the, the small amount, because we also contributed mm -hmm. to the votes that Raila Molodinga got. Sure. So this is what we're asking. I don't think it's too much. I think we should handle this thing amicably. And I want to caution members who are excited to go to the media to throw <laughs> spanners here and there so that uh, there is a psychophantic approach. Let's look at these things amicably. We have a, we have a, we have a, a secretariat. Okay. And this secretariat, we have a board chaired by Orengo from ODM. Mm -hmm. We have Mudama from Waipa. We have Sakwa from ANC. We have Eseli from Fort Kenya. So that they sit, sit down together in an amicable way and extend the small shares that other political parties deserve. And has That's that committee it. met any time since? I think their plans, uh, okay. I was told their plans, their meeting. I but we've say, seen others uh -huh. have gone to court. Yes. But to me, I don't uh, look at the issue of the courts. Okay. They should remove this issue and discuss it amicably All so right. that we can also be given our share because we contributed. And as for Dr. your information, NASA is still there. All right. It's still existing. Dr. Chris Amala is still very committed to the National Super Alliance.